better username. Do I stream at an awful time for you? I feel like I probably do. Thanks for stopping in though, dude. Um, every day this year? Well, besides January 1st, but January 1st I spent making sure the stream works. So I was still sort of interacting with the stream in some way. Um, let me see. This music should be the perfect volume at the moment. Maybe a little bit loud. Might put it there. That should be good. That's better for me anyway. What I really should do is turn all the volume that I have up and then manually turn it down through the actual... I don't know. I'll, I'll sort something out. My audio is pretty inconsistent. I realized watching back some of the VOD yesterday, the game was extremely loud. But anyway... Fender, how you going, dude? Good to see you. Good to see you. 12 days, 12 days. Um, that's right. That's right, June. June G. 12 days. All right, we're jumping into the game so fast today, it's not even funny. I'm giving myself until minute 10, and then we're starting the game. Um, I feel like I should probably just reiterate with the, with the VOD situation. I haven't done it yet, but I am going to do it. Uh, soon the Arkham City VODs will be, uh, unlisted. And that means... Yeah, let me check something. That means that I've made a command that will link you to the playlists and stuff. So if you ever see a VOD that you wanted to watch, that you missed, and it's not on Isaiah VODs by the next day, it's probably in the playlist section. Uh... I have my reasons for wanting to do that sort of thing. It won't be for every stream, though. It'll just be when I'm playing something that will likely be put into a video. I think I think Isaiah Vods has gone gone ahead. Their name is not Isaiah Vods, by the way. It's I'm I'm pretty sure it's I am Pumpkin Pie or just Pumpkin Pie. It's it's been a while since I saw their username, but. I think they've already gone ahead and put it into a playlist for me. All I have to do is unlist them now. Does this... Does this person know how to... Not help me? Like, everything they've done is immensely helpful. It's just, it's just like, on their own volition. Thank you, Isaiah Vods. You are a legend. Can we get a shout-out to Isaiah Vods? Um... But yeah, so I'm gonna be doing that at some point. Uh, I'll probably do it today. I don't know. Um, if I remember. I've got a bit on my plate at the moment, but... You made a LEGO Batman 1 mod? If you link me on Twitter, I'll, I'll see it eventually. Um, started over the Gunslinger, forgot how good the book was. Dark Tower 1 is very underrated, I feel like. Dark Tower 1 has a writing style that you don't really see throughout the rest of the series. It's much harder to approach, and it's a little bit more cryptic. But, uh, I really, really enjoyed it. It's- it's almost written like... I don't know. It's got a very, very unique vibe. It's not my favorite book in the series, but it's- it's very good. Don't shoot me, I liked the movie. You've been shot. I literally drew my gun so fast you didn't even see me. Very easy to visualize the scenes. Yeah, and it was like... I, I just feel like it's a- it's one of the shorter books in the series, but it just... Even with such a small scope, it felt very long, in the best way possible. It was very descriptive and stuff. That's my book review, very descriptive and stuff. I'll never get over... I, I loved the hints that things weren't quite right in the world that it took place in. There was a lot of little hints that it, it started giving and then became more obvious, obviously, towards the end, but... Um, Thoughts on the Fortnite lore? They dropped it once the collabs started happening. Fortnite lore actually used to go kind of hard, and then it just became too hard to factor in all of the collabs into the story somehow, so they just gave up. <clears throat> Fortnite lore was sick when it was like the Visitor and the, the Meteor and that sort of vibe. So after like season four, I think it went... Oh, maybe, no, maybe up to the cube? I'm, I'm not sure. I can't remember. Is 
Descriptive writing is the best. That's why I love uh, A Song of Ice and Fire. Definitely read The Dark Tower. Descriptive write it, like, it, descriptive writing can mean, like, obviously a bunch of different stuff, but there's definitely books I've read where it goes absolutely overboard, and it, t like, to the detriment of the book. And to the detriment of the story. I thought that's what was happening when I read Salem's Lot. Salem's Lot is a, is a lot of, like, just describing things that are happening and you're not really, and, and describing the town that it takes place in, and at first you're not really sure what the relevance of that is, or if it's just being descriptive for the sake of it, and then, uh, but eventually it sort of comes back around for a big payoff at the end and it sort of makes sense why the description is so heavy in the beginning. But sometimes you just get a book where it's like telling you details that you didn't really need to know. Like sometimes it's better better to just describe a table as a wooden table rather than going into what grain the wood is, what fucking color it is, how old it is, and, and every minute detail, how many divots it has in it from fucking cutlery. Like it just doesn't, yeah. Unless that pertains to something. <laughs> then we probably don't need to know. I read something like that recently, but I can't remember exactly what it was. And it hurted me. How much mogging took place at the table? It's like, I don't need to know that. All right, my time is up. My ramble time is up. Fortnite lore became complicated when they included Saint Samus in the background. I'm so confused. They lost me, Josh. They lost me at... Uh, it must have... I don't know when it was. It was sometime after the cube, I think. I've been rambling for 10 minutes. That's pretty good for me. And the fact that I'm opening the game right now is actually kind of insane. That feels crazy. Alright. Where are you, Arkham City? Ramble time is great. I don't have too much time today, though, because I am busting my ass trying to finish this video um, on time. As long as it's done by tomorrow, but I kind of wanted to do nothing on Sunday. My brain hurts a little bit. I'll probably... We'll see what happens. I might still stream on Sunday, but... I also kind of want to do... I want to go outside... I haven't been outside enough this week. So I'll probably just... I'm busting, I'm busting. Oh, you guys can't even see this. Hold on. Tell me if the music's too loud, by the way. <laughs> Not the mogging tag. The tags are what makes this stream, I think. Good to see you, Limpy. How's it going, Rogan? You're late. You're gonna wear an alternate suit? I don't think I can do it. I really like this suit. And the thing is... Wait, why didn't it give me the opportunity? Okay, there we go. The thing is, I don't really like any of these suits in the Arkham game. From memory, like, animated Batman doesn't fit in this game at all. Dark Knight Returns is ultra beefy. Year one, I can't remember why I didn't like this one. I, I, it's not coming to me. I can't really remember what Earth are. Oh, that actually might be an all right one, Earth one. Beyond looks goofy as hell in this game, like, in general. Uh, that one's all right. I like the blue one. That's the one with the yellow insignia, right? I think I like that one quite a bit, and Sinestro Core is... Ah, uh, goofy. I just like Batman. Straight up Batman. The Beyond suit in Arkham Knight is so badass. There's just something about Batman Beyond being beefy that just doesn't, um... I don't know. It doesn't work for me. You know? So I'm gonna go with normal bag mag. Don't get me wrong, it's cool that these suits are in here, but I... I don't know. 
I think I do. I have heard a lot that Arkham Knight suits her a lot better. Thanks for stopping in, little bat. I'm sorry employment is getting in the way of this stream. That's fucking tragic. So we have started the game. We have officially started the game at 13 minutes into the stream. Do you understand how insane that is? I don't think you get it. It's colder than the snowman's heart out here. I just, I'm wondering how the sound is right now. In, like, with the... Just tell me how the music is compared to the game and my voice and everything, and if one thing's too loud, Look out. then let me know. I thought it would give- wait, has it given me a second chance not to kill this thug? I don't think that was the one that I accidentally knocked out. Pretty good, pretty good. Oh, Jesus. Alright, I don't even know what side mission we're going with today. Um, I guess we could do the AR training. I believe we have identified the cure. Mr. Fox has manufactured enough to heal you and is working on a larger batch for the people of Gotham. The Batwing has been dispatched. You all watch and it tomorrow. The intro screen will finish and he'll jump I'm straight sure to the I end with the logo. Hell yeah, Josh. Thanks for the 100 bits, man. So, wait, was I meant to play this like ages ago in the story Bruce. and this is like a baguette? Dude, thank you. Easy one pain finally. Hopefully you can hear those alerts. I'm not hearing them super loud. Thank you, Baguette. Appreciate it, dude. It's good to see you. Um, so I was meant to do this like before the game actually ended. I think I actually did this one back when I first played this game because you go there and it's not actually a cure, is it? The rare white eyesore is the is the white eyesore after the the void one. Four, okay. I haven't seen that one very much. Oh wait, is it literally on this building with all the people? It is. Okay. Oh, they've they've come to snatch it off me, have they? Why would they just be guarding it? I don't know. I'm not going to question their motives. I'm just going to get mogging right away. I actually had a really psychotic thought this morning. I thought, how hard would it really be to collect all the Riddler trophies? Like, should I do that? And then I came to my senses once I woke up a little bit. And I was like, what are you fucking insane? Do you mind not mogging on me like that so early in the morning? Stay. It's much easier in Asylum. Wait, you did the Asylum one in two weeks? Two weeks? That surely can't be right. It takes like two hours of pure gameplay? That sounds more... accurate. Fender, Jesus Christ, man. Thank you. <laughs> Appreciate it, dude. Jesus Christ. I don't deserve it, man. I don't deserve it. I haven't even gotten the cure yet. I think I just got poisoned or something. Thank you, man. I appreciate that, dude. Oh, this is literally a prank. This is literally a prank. I forgot about this prank. More tea, Batman. Oh, I, I've I? done this before. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. What's going on? I got pranked big Shall time. I tell him? Fender, you're oh, insane, man. So Thank you very much for the support. Maybe I should. Well, it's simple, really. I planted a teeny tiny little idea in your head. A sort of remote hypnotic suggestion. Very complicated stuff. I'm sure you wouldn't understand, but as you can see, it worked. Thanks you're so much, Fender. Appreciate you, dude. That can I'm glad that, that the, uh... Oh, you're liking no, the streams and videos. Tea. It's special tea. My special tea. 
Nice. That Dilmar extra strength he's got. Go to hell, Jervis. Simply put, I made you see what you wanted most. Mm hmm. What was it? Tell me. I'm already cured by this point, but. Oh, tell me. <laughs> so predictable, just like Alice. Never doing what I want without ludicrous Or a kangaroo today? You better be controls. careful, man. They they throw well, hands pretty if that's quickly. What's necessary? It's a good job that you've already taken them. All we need now is a finishing touch. A special new hat. Just for you. I think I just you got mogged. My soldier now, Batman, you will do everything I say. This music is excellent. Oh my god, I forgot how traumatizing this is. See, this is a good alternate costume. I would wear this. This is great. Alright, let's go, boys. This is genuinely a great alternate costume. Surely you can equip this afterwards. Did we mog? I think we mogged up there. That was like a 37 or something. Ow. Alright, I think I'm kind of mogging here. I'm beginning to believe right now. I'm actually believing. Oh, oh, I dropped that 39. Jesus. I should probably punch him in the head, right? Yeah. Oh, I almost dropped that. I don't know what I was doing. This is mogalicious. I'm not going to lie to you. Oh, you absolute fucking animal. You filthy, Sleep. filthy animal. Sleep. Later's brother. I just straight up took his drip. I just, I just stole his drip and stomped on it. Jesus. Holy hell. Henruzel, thank you, dude. 15, 15 months is uh, pretty, that's pretty filthy, man. I appreciate you, dude. And thanks for the one bit, Jurassic. They do count for the hype train, I believe. You, you're doing your part. Um, have you ever seen the show Gotham? I haven't, Fender. It, it looks like... Uh, I definitely want to check it out at some point. Because I do hear especially the early seasons are good. And I've seen little clips and stuff. And there's uh, certain elements of the show that I think I would enjoy. And certain elements not so much. I don't love, I don't love Bruce Wayne being depicted as like particularly bratty when he's a kid and that seems to be what they're, what they've gone, gone with, but uh, I, I, everything else, like the villains in particular seem cool. They seem worth checking out. I don't like young bratty Bruce Wayne. I like when Bruce is like... I don't know. More troubled as a child. I like Bruce to really struggle when he's young, alright? Riddler and Joker were amazing, though. Yeah, didn't they never explicitly say that Old Mate was Joker or something? For, like, legal reasons? But they kind of just made their own version of it. I want Bruce to be suicidal at eight. Look, character development. They couldn't because of copyright. He looks well done, though. As someone who's never really watched any animated Batman media, where do you recommend I start? Um, if you want something... It really depends. I, I think Batman the Animated Series is like, you can't go wrong. But there's not... 
really much continuity, as in, like, everything is kind of like a one-shot. Um, thanks so much, your granny's fave. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Appreciate that, your granny's fave. Thank you for the sub, dude. That is a great username. That reminds me of when I used to call myself Your Nan on, um, <laughs> on Among Us. Holy hell, you just brought back some memories. Um, yeah, the Batman Year One movie is a great starting point as well. I don't know, there's a lot of good animated Batman options. Like, if you want just short and sweet movies, like Under the Red Hood and, um... As long as you don't watch, watch the Hush animated movie, I think you'll be fine, right? I hope you remember me and how badly I mog you, Baldy. Hell yes. Um, yeah, I, I've just resorted to waffling while gaming at this point, but we did do one... I didn't get it. I don't want to level anything else up, really. There's nothing that excites me here. I guess I'll just get a line launcher tightrope. I haven't been recording. I didn't record that whole time. This is why waffling is important. This is what you don't understand. God damn it. Alright, well at least that wasn't too impactful of a side mission. And quite short. Yeah, the, the animated movies do Damien a little dirty sometimes, but so so of the comics a lot of the time, to be fair. There we go. Uh, well, I've hit the recording now, so we can't go wrong. I, I don't understand why that, like, demented bunny bat suit isn't an actual thing. Or is it? Is there some way you can equip that? Place never changes. Think it is? First Batman movie I ever watched was Batman Begins when I was like six or seven and then went to a theater and saw The Dark Knight in 2008. Th those were good times. I remember I saw... I think I saw... The Dark Knight and The Dark Knight Rises in cinema, but I didn't see Batman Begins. Um, you can't equip it? That's a crime. That's a crime. That's a good little uh, mog suit. So what are these assaults in progress? I should probably check one of these out as well, right? Somebody getting mogged in an alleyway? Is there like a certain amount of these you can do before they stop spawning on the map or something? Get mogged. Yay, a political prisoner was rescued. And there's a regular trophy here. You know, if I really wanted to make it easy for myself, I probably would stop picking up Riddler trophies in case I do somehow decide to uh, start doing them. Because then if I have to use an online map, I'm going to end up going to a bunch that I have already picked up, so... I think I'm just never going to do it. And we'll settle with that. I don't know where that political prisoner went, but... Yeah, I watched Brave and the Bold a little bit when I was younger. I didn't appreciate it as much back then, because I want a dark and gritty Batman. But I think I appreciate that show more now. Because that, like, campier side of Batman hasn't really gotten a lot of attention in, in the last, I don't know, 10 or 20 years at this point. Like, it's not really, besides Batman Brave and the Bold and a few, a few offshoot comics, it's like that side doesn't really get explored. And there's heaps of comedic sort of stuff you can do with that version of Batman. I'm not too sure on the quality of that show in particular, but... Yeah, there's a ton you can do with that. My favorite iteration of Batman is tough. I'm not sure. There's a few. There's a there's a lot there's a lot that I don't like as well. 
like I, I would say my favorite is probably I don't know I'm pretty basic I like me a new 52 I feel like the new 52 comics were such a good because before that I hadn't read something Batman continuous I just read like different graphic novels and random issues and stuff like that and when I read new 52 I was like I liked that it seemed a good mix of everything and just a good place for me to re-jump in so I'm pretty I'm pretty partial to that that sort of iteration I think in terms of movies I'm I'm a I'm a Pattinson kind of guy I don't know Oh, and Arkham games are all, the Arkham Batman's awesome. He he doesn't really change a whole lot. Like he's just there's not a whole lot of character development, but I like the way that he's portrayed a lot. Um an idiot. She won't last one And uh yeah, I I love Pattinson. That was extremely fun. He's probably my probably far and away my favorite movie batman because i don't love bale as much as a lot of other people like bale i really love the the dark knight movies but <clears throat> bale's batman in of itself never really did it for me and uh i'm not a big ben affleck guy besides the look i think ben affleck looked really good but i didn't like his any of his movies enough to any of his batman performances enough to like have that in my favorites or anything. Though I think he looked really cool. I remember when I first saw him, I was like, oh, they're doing like a beefy Batman live action. This is going to be kind of crazy. But uh, I don't know. Affleck poo poo? I mean, any of them. I mean, that's the thing. I love the Dark Knight movies, as I said, but I don't super love Bale's Batman. So, if something's a good movie, either way, it doesn't really matter. And I don't really like any of the movies that Affleck is in with Batman. I didn't even watch The Flash. I just didn't even care by that point, but... Alright, I'm flying around aimlessly. And Kevin Conroy's like... It depends what category where we're going in all right where's the next We've got a riddle a hostage there Augment. this is all ar training hey batman can you hear me it's officer jones back at the museum hope you can hear me oh wait we've got an upgrade we haven't collected is this even a thing why did we not do this during the main story There's more Catwoman content. I'll, uh... I should probably start upgrading her then, right? Instead of getting the more... Low-key upgrades that I don't really want for Bruce. Yeah, no. Line, the reason... I love Pattinson's Batman so much is not only do I love, like, the... The vibe of his Batman, the aesthetic of his Batman, and and like the characterization but also the movie was fucking great so it just ticks all the boxes for me really so money man thanks for the sub dude appreciate you giving me your uh your, oh wait was that a prime no that was a sub appreciate your subbing dude I love how when he, when there's, uh, Talk. <laughs> when there's fucking reg, uh, what are these guys called? Thanks for your help. I can't remember. Informants? Yeah, they're informants. I love how even when they have a riot shield, once they're the last one, it just doesn't matter. You just press, you just press triangle and they die. Isn't the remaining Catwoman stuff basically just a fetch quest? Most of the side stuff is like either the trophies or the... Um, like challenges. Answer phone. Hello, Batman. Do you recognize my voice? Victor Zaz. In Holy shit. I'm so happy you remember me. I'll never forget you. 
got a special game plan to that, man. A game just for you. Ring, ring. This sounds like a really fun game. Can this guy stop screaming? Where are you? It's actually infuriating. I actually don't care. Can you stop terrorizing people? It's, it makes for a real audible inconvenience for me. I thought it was gonna kill me. I will kill you if you don't Next. shut up. Jesus. There's another? This. I'm literally gonna have to clear these guys out just to get them to stop screaming. Can you stop mogging the citizens of Arkham City, please? I love how this side mission is just an act of violence. Like, on whose part? Mine or theirs? Um, okay. What were we even here to do? We were here to collect... the... gadget. Right? Is it in here? Get the hell out of... Oh. It's you. Doors unlocked, man. Come on in. Hello? What do we get from these guys? I feel like I've done this before, so I might have done more side missions than I originally remembered. You came back. Cool. I guess you heard Ooh. the radio. I did. What did you find? This. Tom over there thinks it has something to do with mines. He used to work bomb disposal. Ah, uh, so do we just get that freeze mine without look. having to spend an upgrade point on it, do we? A micro chib. Mine detonator. Oh, interesting. Remotely detonates mines to knock... Oh, okay, so... Oh, that's interesting. Can you even get that out of a normal upgrade? Jesus Christ, this dude, he doesn't even like the haircut. He's fucking punching himself over it. I take it you stopped the bombing. Good work. What about the tower exploding? You had something to do with that too, right? I may have. How are you and the other cops holding up? We're fine. You didn't We're miss much, Aaron. I'm doing out. most of the yapping now. We got Stay into the game within 13 don't minutes. Anyone you don't recognize. This is nearly over. Nearly. How many side missions are even in this game? Let's have a look. Somebody said there was like a list. You're going to boot up Gotham Knights for the first time? Which, dude, I'm... You're going to need more than luck, I think. Can I have a look at, uh... Is there like a side mission tab? Shows you what you've uh, completed and stuff? Or a checklist of some sort? Where? Oh, Jesus. Okay, that would make sense. So really, is there only... 12? Interesting. I, I guess some of them... Well, yeah, one of them's the Riddler, which is not being completed. We've done... I guess I'll finish the AR training. Is this supposed to be a funny type game? Uh, it definitely can be. It depends which way you look at it. Is he calling me on the same phone again? This guy is desperate. Speak. Oh, Batman, you sound impatient. That is good. That is very good. You'll need that to solve my little game. Hell you yes. may have heard that I have been providing salvation to the mindless drones lucky enough to answer my calls. Hardly salvation. You've been killing them. That's a question of perspective. For example, from where I'm standing, I can see three little piggies just waiting for me to cure them of life. From their perspective, I'd imagine they see things differently. If you hurt them, Zez, I will hunt you down. I bet you will. But first, a little game. 
right now somewhere in Arkham City there's a phone ringing. I know it's a big place. There's a lot of fucking phones, dude. Take too long and I kill these piggies. And don't try anything clever. I had a friend help me bounce the signal through every relay from here to Bloodhaven. Jesus. You'll never find me. Now hang up that phone and start running. Ring, 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 ring. Okay. So am I immediate? I'm immediately on a time limit. Okay. I'm tempted to just let the hostage die since this was not next on the agenda for me. But I suppose I won't do that. I wanted to do that AR training right there, actually, but you've really interrupted me. Threats of violence, man. It seems to work. You've, you've pushed me in a direction that I have no choice but to go in. Is this hostage just like some random fella? I like to imagine Riddler is just watching me like fly through the city and noting down whenever I do something cool like fly for 250 meters uninterrupted, grapnel boost permitted. Like did he make that rule? He made that rule. I made it with a minute to spare. You can't stop me. Did I ever tell you about my first yeah, he's just got like a little notebook, man. right? Oh, that was fucking so, epic. You get a little sure riddle of bonus for that. My parents were dead and I was rich. So rich I could have oh, wait. I'm meant to be doing something. I wanted, but of course, all I wanted was them back. I now know that that was impossible, of course. That their death served a higher purpose. But back then, I had yet to experience the joy of cold steel cutting through warm flesh. Jesus. I had no idea how I could save these people from the relentless... Look, I'm, I'm not looking at the screen like 50% of the time. You have to understand that. How could I read what you say? Jesus Christ. Give us a moment. Goodbye. No, we lost the signal. I'm going to have to learn some sort of skill where I can move one eye over to the chat and one over to the game at, at the same time. Uh, is that it? Bone boy? I guess, uh... Could have finished the game right there? Wait, why is it show? Oh, these are showing me trophies now because of the informants, right? Why have I got no more phones? Does that just continue later on? I want to do my augmented reality training, to be honest. Alright, so that will pick up on Mr. Zaz later. I don't mind that. I'm not mad at that. I want to do my advanced reality training. But I want to do them in order. It's this one, right? That's next. Augmented reality training online. They don't let you repeat them, right? So this isn't one that I've already done. Why is my mouse cursor there? Oh, because I'm playing on PC. I, I guess it does that while I'm on the map. I thought the cursor had been on the screen for the entire time. That would have been pretty sad. Yeah, nah, 2-2. Two, two. I've, I've played this game, like, two times a long time ago. One when I was, like, around the time that it came out, I think, and one not so long ago. Alright, that's the one we're doing, right? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That was excellent. Was I I see this day. 
All right, we got this, okay? First try, I can see it. it I can see it. I, I know we've got this. There's victory in my near future. Holy fuck, that is going to be insane. Okay. I think I'm going to struggle with this. I don't know about you, but... I'm going to get mogged for hours here. Actually, I don't believe that for a second. This isn't that much different to the uh, last one that we did. I'm going to put on the game of gloves. And I reckon we've got this one. Never mind. I'm going to restart that. Why the fuck did I not jump very far? Thank you. No. This is going to be so easy. Hang on. I know what to do here. Don't even worry about it. This will be symbol. Okay. This will be so simple. Why the fuck does Bruce lose the ability to fly sometimes? He becomes a flightless fucking bird just out of nowhere. Alright, we got this. You absolute bastard. Alright, so we just gotta dive a little bit lower. It's really that simple. Augmented reality training activated. Fucking activate you in a second. This is the one. Oh, that, that was almost it. It was just a little too long. Just a tiny bit too long. Is Isaiah real? In a manner of speaking. Alright, this is the one. I can feel it. This fucking phone is ringing again. You're kidding me. Oh, come on. I knew it. I knew it. I just knew it in my heart that it wasn't that difficult. I just knew it. Everybody doubted. Everybody put me down and said that I'm bad at video games and said that I was not mogging correctly. And look at this jawline now. Look at this jawline now. You haven't got shit to say. That was a game of moment. Alright, next one. Let's tick him off the fucking list. I'm out for blood. Go back to the water. Yeah, I want to see this scarecrow boat that everybody keeps talking about. Whereabouts near the water? Is that the boat down there? Is that it? I'm so curious what's on this boat to make it scarecrow related. Is it just scarecrow on a boat? Have I missed it? Yeah, nah, the, the music is definitely complementing this video game, Lego. It's that boat, right? No, that is just a regular boat. That's the boat that I was referring to when I asked you if that was the one. Flat boat. Yeah, I'm aiming for Bruce and Rob to either come out tonight or tomorrow. So that's the goal at the moment. That's why I'll probably uh, wrap this stream up a little quicker than usual. Because I need to... There is more to do than I keep anticipating. Is the boat in the water? Is it that one? Look at the map. There's no boat on my map. I passed it again? Thanks, Domrox. I hope you enjoy it. 
Right of bridge. What fucking bridge? Near the crane? Oh, this crane? There's a lot of cranes. Northwest. Thank you. Some actual fucking direction. Boat? This boat? It's the bat. Yeah, fucking whatever. I'm looking for a boat. Boat. I've located a boat. Oh, boat? It's gotta be the boat. It's gotta be it. I just need to get up there. I, always knew you were chicken. I am not chicken. I am looking for a boat. You absolute piece of garbage. Oh, it put me on the boat. Must be some kind of joke. It only took three streams? Yeah, it's, it's, it's been a while. What do we got here? What makes this a scarecrow boat? Sequencer? Okay. What do you want from me here? Too far away? How the fuck do I get out of this thing? How do I, why did that take seven presses? Holy hell. North end of the boat? For fuck's sake. Wait, I'm, I'm on the right place? Alright, I'm on the hatch. Okay, okay. Right here? Or is this the hatch? You have to understand there is a, uh... Delay. Oh, here we go. This is so strange. Who the fuck finds stuff like this? Ravage. Ravage. So not Ravage or not Terror. Arkham Terror? City of Terror. Okay. City of... England. Um, City of Panics is not it. City of Ghosts, that's pretty epic. City of Spirit. City of Dismay. City of Damage. This is like... Bad movie titles. City of Horror. This is scary. City of... Come on, brother. Where's terror? I've got horror. I've got damage. I've got dismay. I'm sequencing right now. City of effigy. City of ra wraith. I'm going as slow as I can. I'm going city of vision. City of asylum. You f like, come on, brother. I've got City of Damage again. It better not be Dismay next. I've got City of Freaks. I had Terra earlier? Yeah, how? Now I'm just getting Freaks. Hello. Imagine if I didn't know it was City of Terror and I wouldn't know which one was wrong. It's down? Come here. Think we already locked up? 
There's literally no way I could go any slower. Wait, did I just get it? What do you mean the I Man Street continues? NCTE. I'm literally turning a fucking analog stick. I almost, I just saw it actually. I think whoever told me it's down is a filthy liar. Hang on a second. Yeah. Yeah, right. You have not been mogging correctly or for long enough. Whoever said that. Or what? Oh, it opens the thing. All right. You will be mogged into oblivion. I hope you understand that. This is fucking terrifying. We literally went first person mode. Other? Oh, hang on. We got some uh, biological containment vessels, type threes. They're not cheap. Shipping costs, sundry costs, tax, skip that. Um, live insects for medical research purposes. Jonathan, I hope you find everything to be satisfactory. Mr. Fine was very specific about the shipping details and we have followed them to the letter. By now you will have received the initial 15 shipments. The rest are in transit and will be with you shortly. Signature I cannot read. So that would be Jonathan Crane. The man himself. Why are you dead? So this is definitely a hint to like... The next game then? I know Scarecrow's in Arkham Knight, so... Zoom in on him. And I like... Holy Jesus fucking Christ. That actually scared the shit out of me. Why did he have a seizure in the chair? Jesus fucking Christ, that was terrifying, but why did he do that? That was so goofy. Oh my god. He mogged. I think he might have mogged. Like, he's been mogging. Like, the evidence is clear, but... Mog overdose? Jesus, I'm out of here, dude. If it wasn't for this calming music, I'd be in trouble. Well, that was eventful. I'm not sure if, if it was worth the mental anguish of the cryptog cryptographic sequencer. But, uh... It was pretty cool. Stay there? You want me to fucking pull up a sleeping bag and just chill in here with him? I don't think there's anything else we can do, right? That was it? Alright. That's pretty cool. Was that in the original game? Or is that something that was added with DLC? Is he a muggle? Is Batman a muggle? That's in the original, damn. That's great. Yeah, Sean, that's your treat, man. We did that specifically for you the entire time. All right. Uh, what is it? We got our next AR training. Is are we on number three? Augmented. That's number two. That's number four. So we did number three first. I suppose it doesn't matter. Oh, damn, so they really planned this out as a trilogy, I guess. Good to see you, ZZ Meeks. Or should I say ZZ Meeks? Bender, you're insane, dude. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate that. Thank you, gifters, people. I want to see, I want to see a We Go Gym 07. Big thank you for Mr. Fender. Appreciate the support, man. Uh, I will AR train now. 
Yeah, so I guess... Oh, Jesus. Yeah, that, these are the teleportation brothers. I shouldn't fuck with them at all. Oh, there's multiple... There's multiple siblings. Get mogged. We actually kicked somebody off a building. This is glorious. Thank you very much. Okay, so... Yeah, so they planned a trilogy, clearly. Why did Origins even come into the picture? As much as I like Origins, or at least remember liking Origins, what happened there? What's the what's the story there? They just like what did the higher ups demand that there be another game or something? And they couldn't make it in time? Jesus, these two year quotas and shit, man. So who worked on Origins again? Warner Bros. Montreal. So just another case of we want more product to sell. You can't make quality product in time? Make anyway. Although Origins from memory is very impressive for a game that would have been made in two years then. Jesus. I more so mean like they probably expected night that was pathetic uh they probably expected night within the time of like two years which just wouldn't have been possible it was made in less than two years well there you go i got it but it wasn't it that was not gonna work out well yeah who voices batman in origins then I'm gonna hate this one, I think. Where is that last checkpoint? Wait, Troy Baker does it? Troy Baker's Joker, yeah. I don't remember Troy Baker being Batman in Arkham Origins. Have you seen bald and decrepit Superman in Harley Quinn show? No, I haven't, but I have seen a bald and decrepit Superman. Actually, he might not have been completely bald. What's that movie, what's the animated movie where they, they lock Superman in like a prison bunker thing so that he can't get any sunlight and then when the heroes find him, he's like, he weighs like two kilograms. What one is that again? Is that Flashpoint? I'm seeing some conflicting answers, but mostly Flashpoint. It's been a while. Yeah, that's my Superman. He on that 300 calories a day diet. He's cutting after a bulk. You can't blame him. It was just a really long cut. He's, well, yeah, you don't need workout equipment to mog. So you're right there. Where is it? Where is it? It's around the corner. I'm going to hate that. Please don't. Please don't. I'm just trying to live here. Whoops. I did not mean to grapnel boost there. Augmented reality training activated. Alright, we got this. This is the one. Alright, I'm gonna mog Max in here real quick. Ah. Okay, next one. Next one, I just miscalculated a little bit there. We're going to be fine. Augmented reality training activated. All right, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, I mog maxed there. You see that? Yep, 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 yep. Moggery. Moggery at its finest. I knew we could do it. I knew it. Oh, all right, that one was pretty tense. I'm not going to lie to you. That was taxing. So, how was uh, Troy Baker with Joker? I can't remember that. Is it sort of like, do people consider his performance pretty good? 
I should probably do a Catwoman upgrade, shouldn't I? I'm really keen to play Origins. Like, it has been such a long time. I've only ever played Origins once, I'm pretty sure. So, man, I'm getting, I'm getting like, it's been so long ago. I might have played Origins. I can't remember, actually. Origins was weird for me, but I did really enjoy it. Um, special combo whiplash. Yeah, we'll do something like that. Origins with the whole, like, black mask. Yada yada, spoilers, spoilers. That was pretty crazy. Although, like... From the spoiler that I know about Knight... That you, the spoiler you literally can't avoid about Knight. It seems that they got kind of like, they felt very pressured for every Arkham game to have like that big twist. And uh, that pressure probably led to the twist not being very good in Knight. Because from what I know, it doesn't sound uh, particularly schnaz in terms of twistability. Like, as soon as you try and... How am I going to do that? As soon as you try and force a twist, it's just like... Not a Zebrog, you know? Okay, I'm gonna have to Mog Max this one. Nah. Is there a button to, like, turn around mid-air like that or something? Let me check. So I'm just going to have to fully feel this one out, I think. Yeah, that was just great work. What is happening? I really, I feel like I could have salvaged that. I really feel like I could have salvaged that. It would have been top 10 most epic Isaiah moments of all time. Oh, it's so painful. Oh, wait, I know what I have to do. I'm, like, tackling this the incorrect way. Alright. See you later, Sean. Thanks for stopping in, dude. I'm glad you can stop in at least for a little bit. Hopefully you're feeling better. Um, you have a lot of bread, Jurassic. Please don't redeem a drawing or anything like that. All right, I got this one now. I know what to do. I don't know what to do. I didn't hit. I didn't hit it. Okay, so let's let's just relax for a second. This can this can be fixed. Wait, so you can grapnel boost and it still is fine? Okay. Well, that makes things really interesting. That makes things really cool, man. All right, all right. Yep. Fuck the system. We don't play by the rules around here. Yep, Mogs rise up. Mogs rise up. We were never going to play it the way it was meant to be played. Why would you even shoot me after that? Like, you literally saw me complete some unbelievable feat. And you're still trying to Mog Max in front of me. Pretty embarrassing. You turned on Red Dead 2 and your PS4 is about to explode. It does get like that sometimes with the old PS4. Alright, are we done reality training? Is that everything? Did we train reality to the utmost extent? I think we did. Very epic. Check the list. Yeah, we mogged. We did it. Kick it off the list. That's a moment. That's a moment for the scrapbook. All right. Very epic. So we've got... I, we're not doing Riddler. I don't think that's ever going to happen. So really, for City, all we have left is... 
whatever that is i think that's dead shot um locate the freeze technology that one heart of ice i guess we'll finish the acts of violence that's pretty easy and we'll do the zaz thing um and then we'll do harley's revenge and i think that city like pretty much wrapped up um Me and my homie would stay up late playing Red Dead Online and my mum would get mad because of how loud your PS4 would get. I, I have a friend whose PS4 became so stressed out that it, it caused like power outages in his house and he had to stop using it. It, it, was, it was like actually fucking with... It was causing a short that would make everything turn off in the house. So, uh, you, look, things could be worse. Things could certainly be worse. Um, wait, is there a hush related thing as well? How much like side content is not actually listed on this list here? Yeah, Lego, he must have been fucking hacking GTA 6 files or something with that PS4. Some Amazon Fire Stick placed in the back of it. Ushers the knot started. Okay, all right, sick. So there's... It's pretty transparent with what side stuff is available in the game. How long is rescuing Nora? Yeah, they do a good job with the Easter eggs in this game. Alright, we'll rescue Nora and then I'll call it. Because Nora has been in captivity for quite some time. I managed to track Nora down to somewhere in this area. Alright. Nasally bloke that he is. He's managed to track down Nora to a location. That was epic. That was exactly what I wanted to do. That's the exact direction I wanted to head in. All right, so... Nora. I can't remember if she gets a happy ending or not in this. Do, do they actually get reunited? I can't remember. Now I'm not going to look at chat because I, I actually want to experience this. I'm almost certain that this, this is not going to be a reuniting moment. Um because why would we ever have a happy moment in this dog shit city? But let's see. It is so hard not to look right now, but I'm just not going to do it. If this is as quick as you say, we will only be apart for a mere five minutes, so I think, I think we'll live. Is it an informant? In the middle of the street with no homies? That's foolish. I know you work for Riddler. How? I mean, yes! Please, don't hurt me. I'll tell you everything. There was never any doubt in my mind. I'll tell you everything. No, I will knock you out before you get to tell me a single thing. It makes perfect sense. Right, where's that marker at? Okay, so we just have to look around here. Um, based like we don't have to go into a building for this or anything do we why do I feel like I've definitely done this side mission before I feel like it's back here no what am I remembering it's definitely not us walking into a building type beat, I don't think. I may have to look if I spend too long on this, though. That was epic. That was great. We got a little swim. That's not bad. This is just Riddler's bullshit. Of course it is. I do not care. Hmm. Mog Woman? We will locate the Mog Woman. Nora Mog. Does it give us a hint? 
No. Alright, I'm just gonna look. Near the boat? Inside a building. Go to the Scarecrow boat. Okay. I actually managed to look without getting a spoiler for this side mission, so this is pretty epic. Shit, you've got a gun. Whoops. It will not do you any good. Alright, sick. You good? Where are you going? Yeah, that's that that'll help you a lot. What, do we just go in here? Hell yeah, okay. That works. Yeah, what are you? Oh, God. There's nothing to see in here. You should go away. Yeah, it's, it's the perfect combination, Chops. Alright, so we need to get in here somehow. I'm guessing over here where all the people are would be another entryway. Secret entrance near boat, okay. What's wrong? You two Who's got the guns here? It's you and you. Oh, you're armored, whoops. This is just gonna go great now. Wait, how do I disarm with my thing again? There we go. I'm using my tools correctly. No, no, don't kill him! Jesus! Alright, you stay out of the way. I'm so nervous I'm going to get locked on to you. Just stay out of the way. How do I freeze you again? It's like, um... Oh, you picked up a gun, Jesus. I almost just knocked you out. You're going to be in fucking trouble. It's surprisingly hard to avoid him because I just know that I'm going to lock onto him and one-shot him. Get interrogated. Don't make me hurt you. I'll tell you what I know. Thank you. It's double tap R2, alright. I need to remember that. Okay, Nora. Rescue moment. Near the scarecrow boat, apparently. But how can I really trust anyone when they said that terror would be down on the cryptographic sequencer and it was fucking left? And I'm getting called the Mog Lord. Okay. Uh, I think I see. Yes. <laughs> That's okay, Alexa. <laughs> this is the thing, right? Everybody here apparently is a fucking Arkham City expert. And when you're given a circle this large to find a person in, if you don't go immediately there, if you don't go to the exact fucking coordinates in 0 0.3 seconds, you are a mogless idiot. You're a fool. You've never mogged in your life. So, you know what? We're teaming up, Alexa, okay? There's no need for us to be treated this way. Where is my freeze bomb? There it is. That doesn't even look like a freeze bomb. So get off my back. Yep, see, Limpy, Limpy knows what's up. <laughs> Don't listen to us, you're cracked. Cracked is such a funny word for like any other game besides Fortnite. Did you hear Isaiah's cracked at Arkham City? Like, what does that even mean? That door was cracked. Alright. Next thing I know, this side mission is going to be like three and a half hours long. But we'll see. I actually really wanted to take down the guy with the knife there, but uh, there's a lot of mogs in here. 
hope they like my playlist. Jesus. Don't throw that chair at me. It'll be the last thing you ever do. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I'm struggling. Let me recuperate. Right, I'm getting mugged on. Let me smash that real quick. I knew he'd have picked up a gun already. Get mugged on. All right, we're good. That is a frozen woman. I should tell him. Sounds good, Chops. Thanks for dropping in, dude. Can we get some farewells for Chops, please? Any percent mog run? With a time of three seconds. How do I free you? Do you want freedom or not? I guess she doesn't. I'll just leave then. Oh, you just go back to freeze. Okay. Frozen bait. These thugs really have a sense of humor. Alright, I'll talk to Ice Boy now. Imagine. Don't do it. I'm an expert at this now. You clearly don't get it. You clearly don't get it. Oh my god. They have reinforcements. You clearly both don't get it. Get mogged? Hello? These guys are doing a great job. Hello? Lock on to the dude. I'm trying to toy with them, but I end up just looking very incompetent. Alright, cop that. Jesus, that'd end your life in, in no time. Okay, freeze boy. Freeze boy. Is that him over there? He's in the GCPD building, right? He is. Memory of an elephant. Listen, listen. The, it wasn't that bright red, okay? It was more of a dim crimson. An elephant with it. An elephant with Alzheimer's is still an elephant, alright, as far as I'm concerned. Oh shit, you froze all this. How do I get in again? Why must you make every single thing a trial and tribulation? Do I get in through the roof? Back door near the water? Okay. As I said, memory of an elephant. Where is the back door? We've never come through this door. We've only got gone out of it, right? That's why. What did I tell you? Bullsy's got it. He knows what's going on. Okay. Freeze, I found your ice cube. I mean, your wife. And she's looking cold. I'm sure you already knew that. Imagine he just, like, tries his hand at fighting again. I found her, Freeze. She's safe. Laura, where is she? She was locked up in Warehouse 5B, in the Falcone shipping yard. She's safe, Victor. You can go to her. Thank you, Batman. I doubted you. I am sorry. 
Apology accepted. Let's be friends. Now, I don't want to see you turn up in night and be a fucking asshole to me, all right? Because I did you a favor. So, if he's in night, he better be our friend. Thank you for finding Nora. Let's have some character development. All right. We did a good thing today. He was actually nice in night. Good. Good. I want to see it. I want to see him be very kind to us. Wait, I've got to go this way now. How much story DLC is in Nine? Is there multiple story DLCs? Whereas, like, City only really has one? Oh, this place is a labyrinth, dude. I don't even remember how I got out of here. Because Harley's Revenge is apparently the only thing in this game that adds, like, story missions. I'm keen to play Night, man. It, we're building towards that. But next, after all of this side mission stuff, will of course be Origins, which I'm also very excited for. Alright, I think we're going to call it there. We got a fair bit of progress in there. But I, I need to edit at the speed of light. I need to crank 90s like you've never seen before. I think you're kind of ex inspiring me to play Arkham again. It's a great time. I was kind of tempted, like... I kind of wanted to play City again, just because I feel like I breezed through so much of the, the whole process, but... Going through these side missions, most of which I'm realizing I have played back in the day. I didn't do that Azrael one, I don't think. Um... But it's been a lot of fun. It's good stuff. Have a nice rest of your day. See you tomorrow. We'll see. I make no promises. <laughs> I think things go better that way. Uh, we didn't... No, nah, we didn't finish Big Vic. I guess we'll do that next time. And we didn't record the uh, Mad Hatter part, but it's pretty... Uh, I'll just get it off the VOD, I guess. All right. Find the side quests in City kind of lackluster, but that's because a lot of their conclusions are in Night. Yeah, Night. Night seems to be their big boy, regardless of like story-wise how you feel about it. It seems like they, sort of gameplay-wise, brought about all their best stuff and capped it off in a satisfying way. So I'm keen. All right. Thank you as always, everybody. Thank you to uh, Baguette. For, for the resub, Josh for the 100 bits, Bender for the ridiculous amount of subs, 5 gifted, unbelievable. Thank you, Henruzel, for the resub, dude. Jurassic for the bit, your granny's fave for not only the sub, but also for the uh, best username in Twitch chat award. Um, Sir Money Man, thank you for the sub, appreciate it, dude. Fender for another gifted sub. You are clinically insane. Go to Arkham. Do not collect $200. And uh, Jurassic, thanks for the three bits, man. All right. Okay. I'm uh, I'm really hoping you will see a, a Bruce and Robert Season 3, Episode 2 in your feed. Either, I don't know where you live, but it'll be either Saturday or Sunday for you. So that's the plan. If I don't come through... Uh, I'll come through. All right. Let's just put it that way. Unless it's like there's something that needs to be taken out of the video. I realize that I have a very foul mouth. The fact that I don't get demonetized more often is actually astounding. So um, we'll see how that goes. Basically, unless there's like a huge copyright issue and I have to change a bunch of stuff, we should be on track. So, uh, all right. Thank you, everybody. Have a good rest of your day. Thank you for the support as always. And, uh listening to my crap <laughs> listening to my crap for an hour and 30 minutes it does mean a lot uh hope you enjoyed it and i will see you when i see you thank you for 12 days straight it's been it's been pretty crazy all right i'll do that drastic goodbye alexa goodbye sir money man goodbye western hobo panda big fat lols everybody else have a good one goodbye